Okay, here we have the two slice and motors hooked up. Um, you got a total of five wires that connect between the two. You hook up the stator windings one to one, and then the rotor windings one to one. Okay, I got power on this, so I got to watch out so I don't shock myself. Okay, now put them here to wait and see. If you look carefully at the shafts, when I turn this one here, the other one follows directly. Okay? See how that is? When this one turns, the other one follows. So you can have the two motors mounted on two different locations connected together with wires and you just transmit the motion from one place to the other. Okay, very short demonstration. That's it. Okay, you can see the size. That's my hand. You can see the size there. I don't know. I would guess, let's see, that's about 25, 50, maybe 60 millimeters, 55 millimeters in diameter. And, you know, maybe, maybe 100 millimeters deep. You know, pretty, pretty handy size. Okay, that's all.